Hey guys, uh, how are you all? So today I am making this video on a special request of one of my viewers, Nitin Jha. I have already uh, completed the series of cost accounting, but I am making this video on machine hour rate again. So let's start. First, let us uh, understand what is machine hour rate. Uh, suppose you are running a factory and uh, machinery is predominant there means there is a little or practically no manual labor in this basically we have to calculate the cost of running a machine per hour all right so first see the format after reading uh, after reading the question just write down certain things like uh, value of the machine it will be there in the question life of the machine and scrap value of the machine all these items will be given in the question all right now you have to write the depreciation how do you calculate the depreciation value of the machine minus value of scrap when you will deduct value of scrap from value of machine you will get depreciation value all right after that you will write estimated working hours it will be there in the question okay like uh, suppose uh, um, no next you will write uh, repair hours and then effective hours uh, so as we all know that if we are uh, doing the production of something we need machines if machines are in continuous use for production then it is uh, also it also need some repairs so the time taken by the machine in repair is called repair hours and in those repair hours machine does not involve in production that is why we have deduct estimated machine hours estimated working hours minus repair hours so that we'll get effective hours in which a uh, machine was actually involved in the production all right that's why we have done this all right now you have to make the format uh, and you'll get all these information in the question paper uh, after the format okay let me show you the format see this is the format computation of machine hour rate first you'll write machine hours is equal to effective hours whatever the effective hours will be 14 15 or whatever you'll write here okay then particulars per annum and per hour because we have to find out the cost of machine per hour that's why per hour so you will start with the standing charges uh, i guess you all must know the meaning of standing charges uh, standing charges are those charges which does not depend on the production and which are always fixed say for example rent of the factory or light or salary of the workers etc these all these things are fixed okay after writing the standing charges you will write here total standing charges and you will write the after adding all the charges you will write it here now you have to find out the charges per hour for that what you need to do is you need to write total standing charges divided by effective hours and we have already calculated effective hours above all right now after writing all the standing charges you have to write the variable charges variable charges are those charges which depends on the level of production as the production rises variable charges rises and as the production uh, like decreases variable charges also decreases according to it okay so variable expenses like your depreciation repair and maintenance etc and like you did in standing charges you have to add all the variable charges and then you have to divide it with the effective hours you will get per hour variable charges all right this way you have to draw the format of this machine hour rate okay uh, okay so now i hope that you have understood the concept this time Okay, Mr. Nitinja. All right. And yes, guys, one more thing. I have a lot of views on my videos, but I'm still very disappointed because there are very less likes and very less subscribers on my channel. Uh, does it mean uh, you are not liking my videos? Actually, I'm very confused. So it's a request. If you want me to make further videos on marketing and economics, please, please, please do like my videos and subscribe my channel. You can comment also in the comment section like Nitinja has done and I have made this video for him on the special request. 
and yes i have got 2017 question paper of marketing if you want me to make video on that then do like and subscribe my channel all right okay guys bye bye